Why are you digging through my panty drawer, Leslie? Well, because before the store was filled with crotchless panties and stripper bras, <laughs> it was my scented candle drawer. Elliot's lovely, but he seems to only know how to cook with cumin and curry. Okay, can we just talk for a second about how you used to have an entire drawer dedicated to scented candles? Maybe another time. You know, it's funny, but I realized that I really don't have any other girlfriends here in New York City, and you were sort of my only one. Well, maybe you should take that as a sign of your horrible personality disorder. I'm sorry, but I don't see you cruising around town having cocktails with any of your gal pals. Okay. I guess we didn't have a lot of girlfriends in high school. Brittany doesn't count because I was in love with her, and I guess I had Quinn, but the fact that she lives an hour away and I never thought about calling her should say something to me. Yeah. It sucks that we were all so competitive about boys and solos. I mean, you know, Kurt and Elliot are great, but it's just different having someone who really gets it. I just don't understand it. Why my part? Why my understanding? There was an opportunity. And I took it. You would have done the same thing. And then you would have fought to take down whoever was in your way, even if it was me. New York City. Whoa, you two in the same room and there are no stitches? That's an improvement. We're just going to rehearse. Uh, Kurt picked up the best trio song ever. I was just leaving. Yeah, I'm going to go to it. No, 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 babe, stay. It'll make me feel less guilty about being okay with Kurt kicking you out of the band. <laughs> Actually, it'll work. Hey, for the record, I think you guys are both amazing. If you manage to patch things up at some point, I would love to sing with either of you or cook some curry. We all would. Right, well, I don't really see that happening anytime soon, and I have to go to rehearsal. Oh, I'm so glad that it happened. And I will tell you why tomorrow. Hey. Hey. So, I thought you were going to climb under the window. <laughs> I think I'm retiring my game. Just see so you're outgrowing a lot of things. No, I freaked out, and I was wrong, and I'm sorry. I thought we were going to have the perfect senior year, and the one that we got has been so weird Thank and really you. hard. And so when I tried to plan the perfect night out, and it didn't go the way that I hoped, I, I flipped out. And I guess I found it shocking to find two people kissing that I never really expected to find kissing, but really, that happens all the time around here. It does. <laughs> it does. Everything is changing. I get why you want to try everything before it changes for good. The one thing I can promise is not to change is that we are going to be friends forever. Mm -hmm. So of that, what do you think is going to happen in this place when we leave? I mean, there's going to be like three kids in the Glee Club. It feels so weird to think about Glee Club going on without us. Well, at least we can leave them with a second national championship for a member of this Now you're gross. Hey, are you, uh, you want to join us? We're just having like, a little senior moment if you want to, you know, take part. No, oh, I don't want to interrupt your power trio. To the night, but then I realized that worrying too much about what you're trying to accomplish actually gets in the way of what you're trying to accomplish. And as a coach who knows what a national championship team looks like, I have to say, you guys are ready. Yes. <laughs> I'm always on crack. For one thing, don't forget your sunblock because this time next week we are going to be in sunny Los Angeles. Yeah. Ooh, LA. Wait, Mr. Shu, Mr. Shu. So for us seniors, this is one of our last Glee Club meetings. It's kind of a big deal. We were wondering if we could just do one last number. Yes, please. We wanted to ask Artie to be part of the trio with us. Yeah, if memory serves, the quartet is 25% more powerful, which is a little slow than that. That's right. <laughs> oh my god, that Artie. <laughs> Don't you know, don't you know, did you just 
Two days, Em. You better start packing. I know you like to vacuum pack all your stuff. Um, I don't think I'm gonna go with you. Better go. Better hey, you're go. a good luck charm. Besides, can't miss a prime wicked baby making time. Well, we can't if one's already been made. I'm pregnant.